yo guys uh you are welcome all right so this tutorial uh, is going to have many harms it's going to have be so explicit okay so uh, a lot of you have been asking me questions about tgi tgi ff psd and all of that okay so if you want to work with that uh, it's very very simple hope you see what i just did now let me redo yeah so this is what i did i drag in like this can you see it can you see my two fingers on the screen you see it you see it yes so i'm dragging it but if i don't want to do that i'll just click here you can see my hand you can see my finger there i'll click on it and then i'll click on this gallery okay but just for it to be fast i'll just have to drag it inside like this do you see it now we have a sign here can you see the sign you can see my hand there we have plus here i think it shouldn't be new to you and then this sign you just click on it okay so we have share that's if you want to share and then slide show it will begin to slide and then rotate all of that you don't really need it now i'll click on it again and then we have duplicate now for example let me rename this okay you see it is untitled name that untitled okay then i'll click uh, behind this d and then i can write the name of the person or anything that will make it can go to where you see the name so that you'll be sure okay so come here and this is mantcam p i'll click on this select okay and just wait for here to hope okay so here is it you see i've imported it and then you can edit it on your own mobile devices hope you understand that now so once i send that file to you this particular file this particular one, Matcam PSD, then you'll be able to edit it on your phone. Okay. So if you and uh, another person want to collaborate your artwork, that okay, you want someone to sketch and the other person paint, this is what uh, you are going to do. Okay, yes, yes, yes. So there's something we call TGIFF before on Autodex, but really, I think uh, those features are very limited now. So just go with PSD. So you can even open PSD files with your sketchbook. Okay, you can open PSD files with it in case you don't know, but if the work is designed on photoshop you may not be able to really edit it very very well perfectly on, ske on sketchbook mobile okay so very soon i'm going to make a tutorial on how you can export your psd like this and then use it on sketchbook for pc and at the same time you can use it on photoshop on pc you see that's wonderful so you can work on your mobile device and then you transfer it to your photoshop and then all your layers everything they are intact you can edit anything whatsoever you want to edit on it okay so thank you guys for watching give this video a thumbs up please guys share it share these youtube links let everybody get to know about this youtube channel and god bless you as you do so